So switching gears a little bit, maybe from away from the really technical into more of the really fun, awesome stuff that we do at Hackbright every day. Um, this is our class picture. We just graduated. It's so exciting. Yay! <laughs> Uh, okay, so first, a little bit about me. Uh, my name's Sienna. I'm an LA native. Um, I studied Japanese and English at Oberlin College in Ohio. Um, I spent the previous two and a half years as a project manager at a tech company, um, and there I got to do some front-end development, some HTML, CSS, JavaScript, and I was like, man, this is awesome. Uh, I really want to build stuff. Um, enter Hackbrite. I was happily accepted. Um, super awesome to become a full-stack engineer, so that's me. Okay, so what do we do all day? What does a Hackbright student do all day? Well, uh, the program is kind of split up into two halves. The first half of the program is all lectures and pair programming. Um, so your day might start pretty early if you're like me, you live the, in the peninsula. I get up at 7.30, which was pretty much unheard of before I started Hackbright. Um, here's our lovely stairs going on up to the second floor. Um, chill out for a little bit, and then class starts at 10 a.m. Uh, pictured here is the lovely Liz, who's unfortunately out sick this evening, um, but she's one of our lead instructors and she's totally awesome. Um, so yeah, we just all hang out, we talk about what we're going to do that day, um, and then we move on into pair programming. Um, <laughs> this is a picture from the, the SF Chronicle, they came and took pictures of us and had a great article about us. Um, so pair programming, in case you don't know, it's where you and a buddy work side by side on code and you each work and edit the same document, um, kind of talk about what you're doing, what your plan is. Um, it's really, really collaborative and this is a great way to learn how to program because you have to articulate all of your ideas, and all of your thoughts. If you get stuck, someone's right there to bounce off of. Um, so this is how you're going to spend the first half of Hackbrite is pair programming. Um, Break for lunch at one. Here's some local favorites. Um, also pictured here are the cool bento boxes we got for going to Future Stack. So you might get invited to tech conferences while you're at Hackbright, which is super awesome. Um, you're also going to have to give a tech talk, a lightning tech talk, much like you know we're all giving tonight, um, where you just have to get comfortable uh, speaking about something you probably didn't know anything about until you had to write a presentation on it and then talk about it in front of your peers. Um, so that's really good practice. And then we do more lectures, talk about you know, how things have been going that day, where people are having problems, um, just kind of get ready to jump right back in. And then there's more pair programming. And then probably around 4.30, <laughs> your brain's gonna fall out because you're learning so much every day and you're probably using your brain in completely different ways that you're not used to. It's so much information, it's so exciting, um, but this is totally normal. <laughs> This happens to everybody. Um, you just get tired and it's okay. Um, and you go home and you go to bed. Special shout out to Micah. Thanks for letting me use your pictures. Yeah. Uh, and then the second part of Hackbright, um, which is really awesome, is you get to build your own personal project. Uh, and I know that I was really intimidated by this when I first found out about Hackbright in the program. Um, I was like, dang, I can't come up with something that I'm going to build in five weeks. Um, but I think this really sets Hackbrite apart. Um, this is really good for you, uh, and it looks awesome to have on your resume to have uh, something substantial that you've worked on. Um, in the project phase, we start out with a scrum. This is a part of agile development, um, which is super hot these days. <laughs> so, um, you know, it's just a, it's a standing meeting. You just all say where you're at for the day, talk about, you know, what problems you might be having so that an instructor can come help you. Um, and then you program, and you program, and you program, and you program for weeks until it's career day. And then you show off your project to a bunch of awesome people who come and are talk to you and are super excited about it. It's really great. Um, some of us, I think, are, including me, are going to be demoing our projects after the talk, so um, please come talk to us. So you can see them. It's cool. Um, and then there's just a couple other random things I wanted to mention. Um, Hackbright has a mentorship program. Uh, these are all our lovely mentors. Um, you get three, which is a lot, um, who you know, will help you talk about what it's like to be in the industry. They'll help you, you know, with your whiteboarding practice for your interviews. Um, and this is a super awesome resource, and it's so great that we have so much support from our community. Other things that might happen are evening events, just like this one. Um, tech talks that'll go on. Awesome alumna come back and give talks. Uh, and hackathons on the weekend. This is from Silicon Chef. Um, which was pretty sweet at Stripe. It was a hardware hackathon. 
Um, and then really the best part about Hackbrite is the community. Uh, this is a picture of the inside of the bathroom door. These are all notes of encouragement. And someone started leaving these notes and we don't know who it was. Uh, just, you know, saying you can do it, you're awesome, you're super smart. Um, so this is the kind of love and support that you can expect if you are part of Hackbrite. Um, so this is me. Please come talk to me if you want to know anything about Hackbrite or any of the people wearing these awesome hoodies. Um, chat, chat with us. You know, we really are passionate about the program, and um, I would love to give you a business card that says Sienna Guayo, software engineer, because I'm not going to get tired of saying that. All right. Thank you, guys. <laughs>